hey guys welcome back to my channel I know it's been a while but I'm back if you're new I'm Devine don't forget to click that subscribe button right here down below I saw this makeup that JLo's makeup artist that Scott Barnes did on Tati when I click on it I see it's like one year now since that has been up and I'm like where have I been I seem to be living under a rock um, Scott Barnes if you don't know is JLo's makeup artist among other things he has his brand going for him so on this video he's gonna be doing Tati's makeup and from what I saw it's done totally different from what I'm accustomed to so I'm gonna try and follow along with him and see how this one will turn out I always start with contouring I always start with the dark and then I see? add the light it's not about contouring on top of makeup sometimes it is but not usually so I'm gonna treat you as though we were doing like a video shoot music video or something uh, yeah you guys like gonna sing for you at the end of this okay so I'm going to use all nighter, right? What I like to do with this is to bring it in and you just use it to like eliminate stuff. You don't use primer? For what? I don't really need <laughs> For what? <laughs> I don't really need to it. To fill everything oh. in. Wow, this is a look. I like the... All right, so as you see, he's going straight into the contour and he didn't use any primer. I think he's using Urban Decay Concealer. I am going to be using drugstore because, yeah. I think you got like this and then. So this is always the question, right? So mm -hmm. I bring the light right all the way up to the edge. Really? Sometimes you see really bad nose contour and it looks like they're behind bars. You brought it up right up here. All right, what next? Because she goes, look, it's like a cat paw. I love that. So anyway, um, what I like to do with it is just kind of blend it out and just work it into the skin. I see he's using um, a foundation brush to blend this out. So I'm going to follow along. And I don't know how this is going to turn out, but I'm just going to follow what he's doing. And for the nose, I see brush upwards with the brush this way, not down. So, it's kind of weird, right? <laughs> the reason why I always hit the chin mm -hmm. is because you want this to come forward, you it makes things sharper. All right, so you brought the concealer up to the lips. Let's see. Alright, so for this part, he's starting to contour the jaw area. I'm going to be using the Makeup Revolution Contour Stick. Sorry, the Makeup Revolution Foundation Stick in F18. And he went up like this and then down. Are you seeing it? He went up like this and then down. And then he went like this and then blend it out. Take away this chin. And that's one of those things early in my YouTube career that so many people do. You have haters? Oh, sure do. I don't. The whole camp. Oh, Scott. <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> that's all I need to So you do makeup differently per shoot, per lighting. Like you really. Oh, the first thing I do when I walk in? Look at the lighting. This is where people really mess up with contouring. They over contour and then they drag all this brown into the nose mm -hmm. and into the side of the face. Now the trick to having a fuller lip is not overlining it to death. All right, <laughs> I'm learning something new so he put some of the contour over the lip. Yeah, around the lip. 
I don't think I need fuller lips than these, but mm, look at that. I'm actually seeing why he did that. This actually makes sense. Um, so let me just blend all this some more. So I see he's using a lighter foundation now. I see he put some right here, but he's not taking too much away from the contour. And he's applying the rest here where there is no product. I'm going to use this um, Maybelline foundation and So instead of just eliminating that lip, we're just patting over it gently. Really, no one else does that. It's you where know, you just do the, the contour under and then you do it's pain. everything like you know, on listen, top. I so baby faces in here. That is the one thing that I've noticed. So he's using a cream blush, a cream blush. I don't have a cream blush, so what I'm gonna do is probably use a lipstick. Okay, right, I'm gonna use this lipstick here, this ABH lipstick, it's called um, Pomero. Oh, I see what you're doing, Mr. Barnes. Um, So he's using a pressed powder, not a loose powder, to set her under eye. I'm going to set my under eye with um, this shade here in the ABH, sorry, this shade here in the BH Cosmetics Contour Palette. I'm going to be using the BH Cosmetics Spotlight Highlight Palette. So I'm going to mix these two colors, Dream and Radiance, together. I don't like this brush. Very much. Look at your nose. Oh my god, yes. Razors. Ah. Uh, Razors. I just Razors. had plastic surgery with makeup. Yes. Wow. Okay, so lip. This is number seven, which is called naked or natural or nude or something like that. So remember our little contour? Mm -hmm. It's underneath there. So I added my lip gloss like he did. I know he's doing the brows. And I'm not sure if he's Take using Take over. I just cream. kind of build them up slowly. Senna, do you use? I love Senna. I'm not sure what to use. I'm just going to use a... Um, Powder. So basically what he did next was the eyes and um, so I'm just going to do my eyes and then I'll be back. So I did my shadow and my lashes and here I am. This is the result and from what I'm seeing here I'm liking it. I saw what he did here especially the lip contouring the lip. I see a difference. Actually doing the contour before actually makes sense. It's feeling so light like I don't have, um, I'm actually not wearing much makeup on my face. Don't look too close to my lashes. They're not on properly but if you're interested you guys should go and check out the full video on Tati's channel. You did a few little more things on her but what I really wanted to follow was the base of the makeup and I really like how it turned out. I'm definitely going to be doing this routine again and probably tweak a few things here and there so let me know what you guys think in the comment below about this routine i hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to stay safe stay blessed and stay tuned for more bye